Part six, ladies and gents, welcome back. What the? Alright, that was weird. Alright, let's do one more side quest, shall we? Before we jump back into the main story. What's a good one? A Knight's Tale. Hmm. There can only be one. I said I said that backwards, but same thing. All right, let's go fast travel there. Oh, it's just right here. Huh. All right. So we're taking a dive. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this walkthrough. I sure am. And hopefully you guys get this expansion. Uh, I highly recommend it. Highly recommend it. Now, I saw a comment on some forum saying, should I play the, or I haven't finished uh, finished um, the main base game, Wild Hunt. Should I jump in Blood One? I said no. Even though so far, there's only been one throwback, I guess you could say, that when Gerald has the conversation with Re uh, Regis, and he's like, um, I found Siri. We defeated the Wild Hunt. I'm like, okay, so the game the expansion does I take place. On water, just like. <laughs> like who? Like a pond skater. Who are you thinking? <laughs> no matter. I suppose you thought nothing else in life could surprise you, eh? Wrong. What? Anywho, yeah, the expansion Blood and White takes place after Wild Hunt. Play Wild Hunt first. Hey, happen to know how the hell I can walk on that water? Naturally, I know. Since time immemorial have I dwelt in solitude on this shore, and I can testify to the extraordinary nature of the lake. What's so extraordinary about it? I mean, besides the fact that you can walk on its surface. A sword, most wondrous, lies in its depths. I watch over it. The blade may be grasped solely by one who possesses the five chivalric virtues. Folk call me a lot of things, but virtuous? I don't know. Yet I do know. For I know who you are. You have proven yourself capable of great sympathy. You are a man of honor, as many can attest. Of humble means yourself. You show generosity to others. Your valor is the stuff of legends. Reason guides your actions, as it does those of all who are wise. You have proven the five chivalric virtues dwell in your heart. Mean the sword's mine? I can dive in and take it? The sword deserves the hand of a master. You must prove your skills are worthy through combat atop the water's surface. Are you ready? Anytime. Then draw your blade. Come on, come closer. Oh, God. Now I just I'm looking at lightning outside my window. Wait, so can I not use any potions? Because I want to use. That. Huh, I wonder. Oh, okay.
What do I got to face old man for? So I'm really loving all the callbacks to The Witcher 1. First the Manicor, uh, the Manicor, not Manicor, Manicor armor. I have no idea if I'm saying that word right. Forgive me. Now this, The Witcher 1 Silver Sword. That's funny. Even though I have not played The Witcher 1, which is like, ugh, that combat. Ugh. 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 Got him. White screen. You have proven worthy of wielding the blade. Beyond all doubt. Behold, your Arendite. We've met before. Certainly. The Hermit admitted he knew you, remember? The Lady of the Lake. It is I. Forget not that you are a man right and honorable, devoted to doing good. And for these reasons you received the blade. Now bear it. And I trust this time you shall not lose it. That was awesome. Just wonderful. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, we are definitely equipping this bad boy. I guess I won't be getting um, my Quinn, which I'm going to call it. Let's see. What do you guys call it? Not you guys, but. Yeah, so now I'm going to only use the. The third tier one. How much time we got left? That didn't take so long. Only 11 minutes? Let's do another side quest. God, that's so awesome. Awesome, guys. Awesome, awesome. Okay. Let's do this one. Jeez. Place a little wreck. Camp's abandoned. But a lot of this damage is recent. Guess I arrived just a little too late. Should look around still. Huh. Oops. Signs of a fight. Paw prints, beastly ones, that's clear. Just on this spot, though. Hmm. Aerial attack. Must have been. Blood. Of the fresh variety. Monster attack was recent. God, that sword is awesome. Blood. Of the fresh variety. Monster attack was recent. You just said that, Geralt. 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 Man, bled to death. Big beast inflicted these wounds. Clear from the claw marks. Must have a toothy smile, too, judging by what ripped his throat open. A toothy Dracanid. smile? Gotta be. Maybe a basilisk? Except these prints don't belong to any variety I know. Just a little different. Area's dangerous. I'd say there's a basilisk nesting around here. He'd be wise to remain at some distance. Yes, I'm familiar with the matter. And quite proud to say a basilisk does nest here. I look after it personally. Look after it? It's not exactly a pet. 
Beasts murdering folk who come through here. Just a minute. It does not murder those who do not trespass upon its territory. I posted a number of signs, warnings, specifically to prevent anyone from coming to any harm. Well, a lot of good they did. Got a freshly mangled corpse right here. Most likely a merchant, the poor bloke. Just today, I learned two traders had chosen this route despite the signs. I came as quick as I could to warn them. Too late, alas. I've instructed my servants. They shall take the body, return it to the family with a generous sum as recompense. Who exactly are you? And how'd you develop such an interest in the beast? Count Borges, happy to be of service. As to the beast, well, this subspecies is our dynastic symbol. The Desalfareses have for centuries signed with the Regulus Platinum. As family legend has it, a female of the species rescued an ancestor, a boy at the time, from a burning building. She took the tyke back to her nest, where she fed him as if he were one of her own youngsters. Malarkey. To be sure, but beautiful malarkey it is. Pay the victim's family's compensation? Why? These lands have been my family's for decades, granted to us by Duchess Ademarta. Beyond them, the basilisk ventures not, hunts not, it does not kill or destroy. Provided it is not provoked. Yet if it does destroy, if it kills, I compensate all for their loss from my own coffers. <sighs> Your coffers? Got a store of sons and husbands in there to compensate for those shredded by your beast? Naturally, I cannot revive the dead, but I do make generous restitution to their loved ones. Just last summer, I paid a leather tooler's widow 800 crowns, this unfortunate merchant's family, to be duly indemnified as well. Where's the basilisk nesting? Any idea? Of course I have an idea. But you don't really expect me to tell you. Those are not toy swords. I know your intentions. Find it myself then. Easy to track with its distinct paw prints. Mentioned two merchants. So I might also look for the other corpse. I just couldn't stop looking at the sword. Alright, I'm definitely gonna make that Manicore armor. Manicore! I forgot, what does a Manicore look like? Is it a lion's head or in a scorpion's tail or something like that? I don't know. Basilisk scales are usually thicker, not nearly so fine. Could be more sensitive to fire, this one. Alas, it is true. Your cast has a terrible fear of fire. She's a highly sensitive creature. Rid your mind of any thought to kill her. You would destroy the last of a species. Strange. These burn marks. Beast venom make them. Subspecies must be highly toxic. It is so indeed. A wound from a sterling basilisk festers long. Need to brew a potion that'll neutralize that. What Austin potion barrels. would that be? Content spilled all over. Must have been tannin in there. Used to treat leather, beast smashed the barrels. That's how the scent got on the scale. Your Coco is so very curious. Strong scents especially intrigue her. Did you the just say Yo Coco? must have drawn her in. Drawn oh, her to I'll the take that. Busted barrels slimed with venom. Hallmarks of an attack. Basilisk must have caught the second victim here. Oh, hold up. Sorry guys, I had to pause right quick. I knew, I forgot. I knew something wasn't right. Where is it? There we go. Survival instinct. Trade that out for more weight to anyway, carry. Got two cents. Venom and tannin. Ought to be enough to track the beast. Why track her at all? Your cast is protected. Her death would forever destabilize the ecosystem. Who knows what would happen? I see unforeseeable consequences down the line. Simply refrain from provoking her. 
Harm her not, and she too will leave you untouched. I've long suspected they do it on purpose. Sent their goods. They seek to lure the Basilisk to destroy their wares. It allows them to demand compensation from their assurers. Can I just like snap this dude in half? Alright, let's go take homeboy out. Odors dispersed. Seems to be everywhere. Basilisk must be high in the sky. Blood stains. Clear as day. Are they clear or you're just the only one that can see it? What's this? Bloodstains. Clear as day. Got it. Sense perceptible again. Good. We don't have to go inside the cave. Here's a second body. Just as I expected. Second victim, but relatively unscathed. Basilisk must have been dragging him back to its nest for later. Dropped him for some reason. Wonder why. Screech. Human voices. Not about to roost at its nest with warriors on the prowl after it. It's a fear. Yamo, Harry, prepare the equipment. Beast wandered off somewheres. We got to lure it back. And who might you be? Funny. About to ask you the same. They call us the Reavers. Reavers? Wouldn't happen to hail from Crinfrid, would you? Aye, we do. But how's it you know? And again, who the hell are you? Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Know your brethren in arms. Bohold, Kennet and Desbrit. New boy, too. Ah, you're that witcher. Aye. Boho mentioned you. Said you swing a mean sword. A professional. Good, you came along. Could take on the brute together. Talk is the venom's something horrifying. Could use another pair of hands. Fee what we've gotten from the guild. We'll share it fair and square. You in? Gentlemen, this hurts my ears and pains my heart. You aim to kill your cast? It cannot be. The creature is protected. If you fear to lose the guild's reward, I shall repay it, and reward you doubly to leave the beast be. You cannot slay the last living specimen of a near-extinct subspecies. Willing to pay, are you? Long as we do nothing? That's rather novel. What say you to that, master? Far as I know, beasts culled the human race by five already. Beast has to die. We work together, we'll make quick work of it. After all I told you of your cast, you would murder her? Or oh, you will regret this, friend. I know folk. I shall tell them you slew the last surviving specimen. Sorry, Master de Salvares. Actually, not sorry. A monster's a monster. Silvery, plaid, or polka dotted. Last or next to last specimen, doesn't matter. It's a dangerous predator that kills humans. Enough said. Herbalists, alchemists, I know many. They will despise you. I shall tell them of a heartless cur who cares not an ounce for balance in nature. You shall pay arms and legs for their wares. More! Somebody plug this lord in's gob, eh? Right, Master Witcher. How do we aim to fight the filth? We've crossbows. Comply with bolts while you do the hack and slash. Or all go at it as a bunch, blades in hand, fire in our hearts. You decide. You're the one with experience.
Use your crossbows, keep her on the ground. Good idea. Did you say her? It's a female, yeah. Here you know, lads. We've alerted Witchery. A hundred spans out, and he spotted what the lizard's got between its legs. <laughs> right now, lads. You've heard a specialist. Ready your crossbows. All good and fine, but the monster's not in its nest. Gotta track it down first. Not at all necessary, Geralt. We looked into it. Gave it a think. Traders use tannin to lure the beast. Who says we can't do the same? You got any tannin? Came into a bit, aye. Yeah, willing to do the honors. There. Grab your bellies! Shoot the bitch down! No, I'm not gonna hit it. I'll hit it the next time. Oh yeah, there's a lot of balance up in Velen. Just gotta find them. God, I am missing every single shot. There you go. Sit your butt down, buddy. Thing. They're dragon. They're dragon, right? No, a hybrid. So I need to find hybrid oil. Where is it? There we go. You know what? I don't think they're a hybrid. Whoops. Gotcha. How long you gonna make it? This is barbarous. What did she ever do to me? Stop! By your cast, do not slay. Like that to fight to the true witcher's side. Prime the way you swung that razor, mate. Mention some fee from a guild. I hear you right. <laughs> Witcher drives right for the gut. A professional, right thorough. Your share, friend. Every last copper as we agreed. We'll collect us a few of them silver scales and the tail. Proof for the guild, right? And we'll get word of you to some folk. Merchant folk, meaning. They ought to treat you right. Thanks, and farewell. Oh. 
I wonder what happens if I go over there and talk to him. Your cast, my poor your cast, cruelly slaughtered like a common beast. Well, he killed five people. So it was just. Alrighty, ladies and gents, this is a perfect place to stop. Thank you all for watching this. If you guys could please leave a like if you guys like what you saw in this video. Please subscribe for more content that helps out the channel a lot. Share my channel and my videos to all your friends, family, cats, and dogs, and whoever who nots. And follow me on Twitter at beta, B-A-Y-T-U-H. And I will see you guys later.